Welcome to PJ's Q&A section. Last week Q&A session, we were talking about the model disappear when using the bowling unit. And you can check out the link here uh, on the right top corner, or I will put the link on the bottom below. But this time we want to also check another scenario from Patrick. Uh, Patrick sent me the email uh, question about why there's no naked edges on all the parts, but parts still disappear. So let's check out it one by one and how to fix this issue. All right, so first of all, let's give it a try. When we try to do the bowling unit, it say it fell. Sometimes the parts will disappear, sometimes they will fail. So let's pick up all of them. Let's take a look on the analyze and then you have H tool and you want to show edges. And here is showing 13 naked edges. So let's take a look on what where is that. If we take a look on this one and we'll find out like this one is not cap, right? So this one is not solid. So of course this will have an issue. Let's just delete it to check on everywhere else. Checking one more time, it said 12 naked edges. And it's pretty much on this guy over here so we are just gonna delete those so we want to see if it is really the issue on the naked edges or it's just the model itself right so we when we look at it this might be the problem but we'll check on it later all right so let's check on it one more time uh, add the object it say no naked edges everything looks good uh, all of both of them or all four or five of them are solid and we try to bowling and it said bowling fell okay now, if all of them doesn't have a problem, you need to check another thing is, do they intersect? Sometimes if they don't intersect and they won't. And in this case, it's not only they are perfectly fine, they also intersect. All right, so when we see something like this, and let me go ahead and delete all of them, we need to come back and look at our original one. All right, so I'm just gonna do one to save the time. And we're gonna delete a bunch of them. That's not looking at those, All right? So double check again. We wanna send this guy, and we wanna check at the object. It say four naked edges. It's actually not naked edges. It's actually on this little extrusion there, right? So we delete those. Uh, let's do one more time. So no naked edges. If this one doesn't have the problem, then it must not be the solid itself. Uh, it must be the curve, right? So we want to find out the original curve. And unfortunately, I don't have the original curve, so I kind of need to create one. I'm going to use the uh, commands called dupe age. And we are going to select all the button, and then we want to join all of them. So in this case, we no longer need this solid right here. We're just going to look at the curve itself. So let me hide this one and let's take a look on the curve, right? Well, first of all, when we examine a curve, we want to take a look on this. It shows it's closed curve. Ideally, you shouldn't have any problem. But sometimes um, when you offset or when you have a kink like this, it always uh, create the tiny problem over there, right? So to fix this, I will suggest you to do one thing is completely rebuild this guy. And right now you have 879 point. We're just gonna make it a little bit more. Let's say 900, so it will be uh, completely fitting into your design, okay? And we wanna rebuild this guy too. Uh, currently have 90, let's just put 91 here. Um, this one we have 90, we put 91 that as well. And this one, let's see, uh, we have 57, let's do 58. All right, so let's do it. Uh, let's give it a try. If I have a new curve right now and they are all closed curve and I'm going to extrude it solid, straight for whatever height that's supposed to be. Okay, and we are going to flow this back to that surface. So we're gonna use the uh, flow along the surface. We're gonna pick up the object. And we also pick up one of the corner and we're coming here to pick up that corner. All right, so now we have this on it. Let's give it a try for bowling unit, this one and that one. So that will be unit um, perfectly. 
All right, I hope that answer your questions. Please like and comment and share my video. And don't forget to click that little bell to get the notification when I have a new video. Thank you, and I'll see you next.